G'day, my name's David Troy, and this is the David Troy Salon. Oh, you have never cut hair before. I have cut my own hair and several dogs. I have the Paul Mitchell book, and stem it. Okay, so what I want to do for you guys today is just a simple updo. You know, what I want you to understand is I didn't grow up playing with mannequin heads. I didn't braid hair as a kid. So when it comes to this, I really had to practice. I really had to learn my craft. So it did take me a long time to figure it out. But all I'm going to do in this updo is I've broken up into four separate sections and we're going to do a French braid in each section, grabbing the hair as I pull it into the braid. Five hours later. So what I actually do is I use a sectioning clip to help me pick up the hair and place it into that middle section as I pull it into the braid. I just found this an easy way. I don't have nails, I don't, you know, it's a little bit harder for me, but I find this a really simple way just to grab that hair and drag it into that middle section as I'm braiding it down. So as you can see, I'm not doing this really tight against the head because I'm going to pull this around into the back, which you'll see in a minute. So I'm just loosely making sure that it's got that movement in it and I'm going to braid it all the way down. So when you're working with a mannequin head, it's a little bit harder because it's, you know, half synthetic hair, half human hair. You've got the flyaways. But as you can see, I'm still using that sectioning clip at the start, just to start it off, just to help me along. Again, I'm not pulling it tight against the head. I don't want this really, really tight. And I know there's people out there that are probably looking at this going, it's messy or they could do it better. Now remember, this is for the end result of the updo, not the actual braid. So now you can see I've done all four sections. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna wind those back sections up. And you can see why I've left that loose and not tight against the head, because I want room there to pin it. So now all I'm doing is working my way around the back of the head, pulling those braids in, pinning it underneath, and then what I'm going to do is just go through and I'm going to pull that braid out just a little bit, just to loosen it and give it a nice finish. And there you go. Look, I really like this updo. I think it's cool. I think it's a nice, easy, really simple way to get a great look. Again, working with the mannequin head, it's a little bit harder and we get a little bit rougher finish than we would on a normal person, but I really enjoyed it. So if you're new to my channel and you've never seen my videos before, I would love you to check out some of my other videos or my hair tutorials. Um, if you like my content, hit that subscribe button. I'd love you to hit that bell notification so you know when I upload next. It would be much appreciated.